Hey guys, Kevin at GloveRelays.com, and today we have a before and after shot of this Wilson. This is an older one. This is a Wilson A2000 XLC. As you can see, this one's definitely seen some time. It looks like it's had some quick fixes done uh, on most of the glove here. It looks like the, the heel's been released, the fingers have been released, the spiral at one point's been released, the web's been released. It uh, looks like the palm has not been released, but we're going to go ahead and take care of that form. But uh, I wanted to show you guys this guy this, as a quick before. We're going to go ahead and give it a full release and tan, give it a good cleaning condition. And we're also going to be putting a piece of padding on the interior palm here. And then we'll give it a, uh, then it'll all be done. So bear with me one quick second and we'll see the after shot. And if you have any questions in regards to gloves and or glove releasing, feel free to contact me through my website at www.gloverelace.com. Hey guys, Thanks Kevin guys. at gloverelace.com. And here is the after shot of this vintage Wilson A2000. This is an A2000, also known as the A2000 XLC Vintage Model Mitt. And as you can see, we went ahead and gave it a full clean condition and relace and tan. And uh, this one actually came out looking real, real nice. There's definitely a little... You can see the ripples here because I went ahead and put a piece of padding in on the palm as requested by the client. This will break down and break in once once the glove is start to uh, once the glove gets back out on the field and, and is used. But uh, there you guys go. It's nice and stiff, ready for the field to be broken in. And uh, yep, there you go. Full release and tan. So if you have any questions in regards to gloves and or glove releasing, feel free to contact me through my website at www.gloverelace.com. Thanks guys.